BO News at 10. We're continuing to follow budget and staffing concerns raised by teachers and students in the Fairfield Community School District. KTVU's John Redfield attended last night's school board meeting in Fairfield and has this update. Two weeks ago, we were informed by an anonymous viewer about concerns teachers and students have with the Fairfield School District. We were told 38 Fairfield Middle School teachers took a mental health day on March 10th, and Fairfield High School students had a walkout to protest the school district on March 15th. Some of the concerns that were outlined involved the district's budget, student-teacher ratios, and communication between administrators and staff. We brought these concerns to the district. Superintendent Dr. Lori Knorr responded with a written statement earlier this month saying, quote, earlier this week, district leadership became aware of issues raised by some of our middle school staff members. Superintendent Knorr and teacher union representatives have been working collaboratively to address the issues raised by the staff members. On Friday, students and teachers followed their normal schedule for a productive day of teaching and learning. The Fairfield Community School District is fully committed to providing the best educational experience for our students. No also says she is proud of the collaboration they have between the leadership, the staff members, and the public and believes that open and honest dialogue is the best way to address any issues and will welcome anyone who has concerns or questions to reach out at any time. I attended Monday's Fairfield Community School Board meeting to see if the board plans to address some of the concerns that were raised this month. The meeting was delayed for two and a half hours for a closed session to evaluate the professional competency of an administrator. We do not know which administrator was being discussed. Board members proceeded with their regular meeting around 9 p.m. Monday. Some of the discussion involved the district's budget, no mention potential cuts that could impact student-teacher ratios. No further action was taken related to the budget. I touched base with administrators after the meeting. Dr. Noll says she will provide an update in her communication with staff later this week. John Redfield, KTVO News. Coming up next tonight here on KTVO News, 